Hi hey guys, this is a video on uh, how to create a new partition on Arrows. In this case, Apollo S, because someone asked me uh, on how to create a new partition uh, using Arrows. Okay, the first the first thing you guys need to do is because Arrows Apollo S is a 16 gigabyte image. Um, and if you flash it in a bigger CF, like in my case, I'm using a 32 gigabyte. Uh, that means that we, are, we have we have a free space on it, and we can create a new partition. We cannot extend the work partition without reformatting. Okay, so this is about create a new partition. Before we do that, you guys need to do, go to work and tools and fix hdd size this will update your drive with uh, the the sectors the, the blocks and select data device okay check drive and it will tell you that the drive is blah 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 in my case i have already done before and the disk is already installed correctly. This is the first step. So back, quit. Fix HDD size. Select at the device because Arus uses at the device, not SCSI device. OK. Check drive. Then update drive. In this case, I have already do this. So and when when you do did when you did this, then quit exit 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 second step is go to arrows tools hd toolbox so this is this is a little different from <coughs> what we are used to see on a, a, on a amiga os but also works well I am testing this until now uh, so far works okay but well it's it's in test uh, okay <laughs> so use it at your own risk uh, or use the in UIE or something else um, the Amiga OS HD toolbox okay in this case i am using the arrows one so hd toolbox add to device okay click it two times it will show you your cf 32 gigabyte ba, 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 ba. click it again it show you the both created partitions now i want to create a new one <coughs> for that i go to add entry add entry and select the empty space this so okay now select the created partition like this and the first thing we need to do is rename it in my case i will give the h2 okay so then we have the switches auto mount okay then we have the dos environment so this is where the difference comes for for the mask for example we need to we need to add instead of hexadecimal values the decimal values so in this case for the mask and I will show you before how it's, it is with the already created uh, partitions. If I go to DOS EVEC, you see I have the decimal values for the mask instead of the hexadecimal values like here. Okay, so this is what we need to insert on the new 
partition doors in back and here delete it and you will you will set the decimal values of 21 47 48 36 44 okay enter and for the mask transfer i don't know if this is important or not because we are using other device not scasi device but anyway the decimal value is 13 oh five six oh so okay leave the block size like this because here is where i have issues if i choose a, a bigger block size then i will become issues i cannot even format the drive so let let it like this buffers 80 buffers is enough and okay you see the max transfer with the, the decimal values if i will click ok and i will show you again how he now shows me for the max transfer the exit decimal exit decimal values okay okay after that let me oh change the partition time the type that's that's this is very important please select custom file system okay okay so i think i have everything okay yeah switches auto mount those environment okay custom file system okay okay now go to parent select the cf save changes yes exit and reboot the vampire yes <coughs> It's rebooting so it will now show you the drive okay now we, we need to format it this is the normal command of pfs format okay the name Oops, uh, uh, name. I will give the name of test like this. And what else? PFS format. Uh, oh, sorry. Before this, PF format, PFS format device. The H2. So now name test. Okay. So quick. No icons. And FN size of 107. Like this. okay enter enter okay it's formatting and there you go that's about it formatted you can change also the icon but for now that's it now you have some you can test it 
by copying some files on it work pictures for example Apollo OS let's check here if the length of the file size is working yes full size okay nice so please guys test this and if you get corrupted data please tell me